The City of Healdsburg Wastewater Treatment Plant is located 60 miles north of San Francisco in the heart of the picturesque Sonoma County. Commissioned in April of 2008, the Mempulse Membrane Bioreactor, MBR system, with B40N membranes consists of five cells, each cell containing 128 B40N membrane modules. The plant was designed for an average of 1.4 million gallons a day, with a sustained peak of over 4 million gallons a day. Over 10 years later, the plant is meeting three-day peaks at 95% of flow with the original B40N membranes. Part of the process for the membrane plant is good maintenance. We've been able to run this plant successfully for 10 years because of good design engineering. Things are laid out well. It makes sense for the operators. It's easy to use. Just like other activated sludge systems, aeration plays a vital role in membrane bioreactor or MBR systems. This computer simulation shows the burst of energy created in a MemCorp MBR module. As the large bubbles of air produced by the MemPulse device rise through the module, the two-phase flow created by MemPulse maximizes shear on the membrane surface by creating both upflow and downflow zones around the rising slug of air. In fact, when compared with air scour in conventional MBR systems, MemPulse uses roughly half the aeration energy for the same membrane performance. This is because small bubbles can't provide as much energy to shear off solids and agitate membranes. Tank mixing is also important. Mempulse acts like an airlift pump to provide uniform distribution of the mixed liquor throughout the cell. This ensures a well-mixed operating zone, maximizing the life of your plant through the optimal loading of all membrane modules in the cell. The reliability we've had and over the 10 years that we've had it here, it's been great. Being able to work from home, log on, open valves, shut down valves, and be able to rely that it's all working here the way it's supposed to, it's been really good. Every week I travel site to site, uh, check up on customers, make sure all the membrane systems are performing properly. The longevity of the membranes has a lot to do with the cleaning process. What this plant does, we find it's way over 99% removal all the time. So this plant blows our requirements out of the water. During the rainy season, uh, we'll have peak flows up to about 7 million gallons per day. Uh, obviously, our plant is, uh, is rated at 1.4 with a maximum of 4.0. So we'll, we'll see the plant easily handle our, our max rated flow uh, for extended periods of time. There was a couple of winters ago where we were running at 100% for three or four days straight on what was at the time eight or nine year old membranes. And so they've performed well even under a lot of stress. Uh, we have had more industry come in, and mostly wineries, some distilleries. Our MBR handles our domestic waste with light industrial with no problem at all. My favorite part of it is uh, interacting with different customers. Service has been great. They're always very good at getting us quotes and getting us the parts here. So my experience with wastewater went from the pond plant to MBR. So it's like Volkswagen to Ferrari. I don't know why anybody has anything else besides an MBR plant because it makes awesome effluent. DuPont Water Solutions. Possibility flows with us.